Aloha, my name is Donna Fisher and words are insufficient to fully capture the significance of my EDD program experience. In July of 2019, I had a major heart attack. After my heart attack, I spent 19 months with PTSD, every day in fear of dying and every day being afraid of living. Then God sent me a gift. I was invited by Chaminade University to apply for their educational doctorate program. After my exceptional experience with their Masters in the Art of Teaching program, I eagerly applied for their doctorate program. At Chaminade, I never feel like a number. I am not a body in a program. Instead, I am a unique individual with passions, goals, strengths, and weaknesses that are all complemented by a robust team of professors with one agenda to guide, support, and encourage student growth and success. The courses are rigorous and at times feel overwhelming, but the professors are right there to support you and ensure that our doctorate students, who are by and large working professionals, can be successful and push through. Every course in my doctoral journey was strategically chosen and carefully sequenced to ensure that I felt empowered, eager, excited, and most importantly, prepared for the next term and each course came at the exact moment where I could utilize the content to positively impact myself, those around me, and my community. Throughout my 51 credit hours thus far, I have learned to think deeper, to reimagine, to question, and to push the limits. My doctoral journey has not only been about acquiring knowledge, which I have in abundance, but it has also been about promoting justice and peace and fostering dignity and belonging for everyone. As for my dissertation, I could not feel more confident and prepared. Dr. Askelson set us up for success with visits from board members and a layout of what to expect. Dr. Chun painstakingly hand-selected committee members perfectly matched to each doctoral student and personally contacted the Hawaii Department of Education to expedite my IRB approval. Dr. Hamilton ingrained APA formatting and how to conduct professional research. And Dr. Hamilton, who's also our committee chair, Dr. Mukina and Dr. Podeski, who are my committee members, have supported and worked with me through every phase of my dissertation thus far. Shamanad's mission to prepare students for life, service, and successful careers has been realized through this doctoral program. It has turned my PTSD from post-traumatic stress syndrome into post-traumatic strength syndrome. Through each doctorate course, I learned more about myself. I learned who I was and what I have to offer others. But more significantly, I learned what others have to offer me. I began to live every day to the fullest, without fear, and with faith, looking towards a bright future. My doctoral pursuit transformed me professionally, personally, and spiritually. Therefore, I am living proof that Chaminade University's EDD program develops the whole student, mind, body, and spirit. One example of the impact the program is having on the community can be seen in how I am using what I have learned about dignity and belonging and leading across cultures to influence and impact hundreds of educators in Hawaii. I presented last year at AMLE and I will be presenting at the Schools of the Future in November. I am a veteran I was an Army officer who led troops both in garrison and in combat. I earned a Bronze Star for my actions in Desert Shield, Desert Storm. So I was ecstatic to pursue a doctorate in education and organizational leadership for adaptation and change. I began the EDD program with no prior doctoral level knowledge and Dr. Hawkins, Dr. Mukina, and Dr. Askeldson laid the groundwork for my doctorate level research and taught me not only what qualitative, quantitative, and action research entailed, but how to actually conduct all three. Dr. Frexel taught me the ethical guiding principles that now accompany all of my professional and personal endeavors, and his course directly contributed to a school system level change where social emotional struggling tier two students now get the support they deserve and need. As for my leadership journey, under the mentorship and guidance of Dr. Chun, Dr. Schroeder, Dr. Hamilton, Dr. Castro, Dr. Nakasato, Dr. Medeiros, and Dr. Hattori, in their leadership courses, everything 
that I thought I knew about being a great leader from my military experience changed. I learned that although well-intended, I was not a leader. I was a task manager. I learned that what I thought was motivational and effective was actually authoritative, autocratic, and micromanaging. I spent term after term reflecting, reading, learning, and changing my leadership style and approach. I invested time in my moral makeup and how I treat others, how I react to events and situations, how I communicate, how I collaborate, and in my cultural awareness. I emerged as an authentic, transformational, democratic, visionary leader. This change not only impacted everyone I work with, but it literally impacted my life. I learned how to inspire, influence, and empower those who I worked with. I became a mentor who desires improvement for everyone. The changes in my leadership were recognized by my principal, Richard Fajardo, who became Pearl City Waipahu Complex Area Superintendent, and he invited me to apply for, and I became a complex area teacher responsible for English language arts and social studies for 18 schools in the Pearl City Waipahu Complex. As part of my first two months in the position, I began July 3rd, I have created a complex area leadership course where teachers from the complex interested in pursuing leadership can join the Leadership Study Council. I am building relationships with principals and school leadership, and I changed my dissertation topic in July to benefit my complex by studying the correlation between reading programs and third grade reading proficiency. I have a much greater understanding and appreciation of diversity, and I have a passion for ethical responsibility and a commitment to leadership that will positively influence and impact individual lives and our community. Thank you for the opportunity to, to share my journey and experiences. I wholeheartedly believe that the Shamanad Educational Doctorate Program is transforming lives and our community at large. Mahalo.